What's up, everybody? Jake here from Jacob Anders Reviews. And I am here today with a Retro Wednesday review slash walkthrough let's play kind of deal again. This week we're playing Sewer Shark. And uh, I am attempting, attempting to do a stream. This isn't an actual stream. This is an offline stream. So I'm really I'm treating this as a stream because I've never streamed anything. So I'm treating this as a stream, and then that way, hopefully next week I can actually start streaming these live with comments and and all that stuff. So yeah, there's that. Uh, so if you see me looking away and kind of doing a few things, it's because I'm still trying to wrap my head around how this whole thing works and probably doing a lot of it wrong. Hopefully this turns out okay because. Putting these videos, these videos turn out to be fairly long. Putting them in my editing software and rendering all that. Um, yeah, that's a bitch. It takes a real long time to render that. And then to upload it to YouTube itself takes a real long time. So, anyway, let's jump right into this bad boy. This is uh, Sewer Shark for the Sega CD. And I had to do quite a bit of... Uh, technical fuckery to get this to work, but it's working nonetheless. I think I'm I'm hoping to God you guys can see it right now. <laughs> but anyway, uh, yeah, Sewer Shark came with the second generation Sega CD, which actually came out a lot. Uh, came out not too long after the first generation because the first generation Sega CD sucked so bad. Or it didn't suck, but it, it broke real easy. Ooh, that brings back memories. But it, they weren't very high quality, the the under, the over-under version, the original one. So the second one came out, which was the side-by-side. -side. It's a bit more, uh, Sega! It's a bit more reliable, and this was the packing game with it. So it got a lot of play. Um, supposedly... This is the first full motion video game ever made. Sony. This is a Sony. It's not really a Sony game. They just published it. They had to do it. It is a digital pictures game, which digital pictures made a ton of the games that I love from my childhood, which is what this series is all about. Um, full motion video games. They get a lot of hate, but I, I enjoy them. They bring back lots of memories. They're goofy and corny, and gameplay is sewer sharp. Gameplay is usually pretty weak, or, or light rather, as it is here. Uh, Sewer Shark is more or less a rail shooter. Her main man. Shoot the tubes. Alright. I remember the story in this game being fucking batshit crazy. Like they end up on a beach and like the like the the guy in charge, the mayor or something, is there talking shit the whole time. Oh, this guy. The guy you're replacing, he had that same tough guy smirk on his face. Just like last week's burn cycle, you can see that the system that they were putting this full motion video stuff on wasn't really uh, strong enough to handle the, the full video. Let's go, rookie! That's what this guy does the whole entire game. He just yells at you. Yells yells in your Take face. Breath, Super over the top. But I love it. Smell of what in the morning? This here's the whole hog. The I whole hog. I put her back together again. No matter what they taught you up in the top rat, factory jobs ain't worth scrap. I got some stuff in here. It's not all strictly legal. Anyway, um... This is also much like Night Trap. Um... Dog meat. No, like in Fallout. Dog meat. But like in uh, Night Trap's case, this game was actually made for the Hasbro system. The Hasbro VHS system that was never released. 
back in the 80s. Um, and a lot of those games, if not all of them, that Digital Pictures made ended up being on the Sega CD. I, there's no way to get this game digitally right now that I know of. I couldn't find it. At least. Not like legally. It hasn't been re-released like a... Like on GOG, GOG is real good about releasing old, older games. Even in their original versions, not necessarily a tube steak. Did he say tube steak? I think he said tube steak. A million pounds of tube steak. Or maybe he said miles. I don't know. I wouldn't listen. I was talking. Oh, here we go. We're about to get into the game. Let's find out. I have fond memories of this game, but. <laughs> it's fairly simple. I think you just like fly through the. It's a rail shooter. You fly through the sewers and shoot giant rat monsters. Run data, evaluate. And have to just follow the directions of what way to turn. Not very deep. A complete cranial evacuation is a no-brainer, Mr. Ghost. Something down there sucked their brains out. Coordinates. Well, they were the, I will give this game that, or this, the, we better keep in close touch the production today. values, sure especially for, I mean, it came out in 1992, it was shot sometime in the 80s. They, they claim, okay. if you look on Wikipedia, that this is the first full motion video game ever made. I don't know if it's, it came out before Night Trap, so it may very well be the first one ever released. Whether it was the first made or not, I don't know. Honestly, it's simple, but the production values as far as like special effects and whatnot aren't that bad. And like the ship, like that, that doesn't look bad. It's corny as all get out. This, is, this game is corny as fuck. Maybe it'll be fun. Maybe it'll be fun. Oh, I remember this part. Oh. Oh. And this is what the game is from beginning to end, pretty much. This is this right here. Three. Oh, shoot, I missed my turn. It's three, six, six, I think it's it. The little arrows you see up top, you have to like hold the B button and hit that direction to, to go that direction. If you miss too many times, you'll wreck. Oh, oh I was supposed to go that way. I was I am not doing. I'm not doing so hot. <laughs> it's it's been a while, like you know, 30 years or so. I think I need to make a right turn. Uh, also, by the way. I do own this game, actually, on the Sega CD, and I own two Sega CDs. Unfortunately, when I broke them out to try this out, neither of them work. <laughs> so, while I do own the game, 639er, okay. So. See, I said 639er, you just have to follow those. First time I get a 6 down, I have to go that way. And there it is. But yeah, I, um... Way to go, buddy! Way to go, buddy! Oh, bats! I forgot about those. Three. The, uh... I really don't know, do I have to kill these or not? I don't... I guess I get points. But I don't think they hurt you or anything. And a recharge. Uh, I don't know how you go. I can't remember how you go into a recharge. I guess you just niner. <laughs> Technically, this is all in-camera shot with these tubes. It's just repeating the same shit over and over, but. So I guess the whole thing is full motion video. There's a lot of full motion video clips throughout this game. With its 
from what I remember batshit crazy story. Uh, honestly, I'm, I'm not going to take this, take anything from it. This... Nine or six, six. The game doesn't look bad for a 1992 FMV. I mean, it ain't great either. But the production values. I'm sure this is all models, of course. It's not real future sewers, but it all, the models all look really good. These bats are getting to my fucking nerves. The audio's cutting out. I hope that's my headphones. And not the stream. Ooh. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, my Sega CDs, both of them were broken. And wouldn't wouldn't even turn on. So, I did get an emulated version of the game. And that's what I'm playing on, so I'm not actually using a Genesis controller, which is what the game was designed to play with, but I'm using an Xbox controller on my PC. So I had to like remap all the buttons. Woo! Damn! Ah, oh, I missed it. Had an itch. I need another down. Ah! <laughs> and like that, the game is over. <laughs> if you miss too many times, which I guess I did, you you crash, or if you miss in the wrong place, I don't really know. Anyway, I'm pretty sure this game doesn't have save spots either. I don't know if the emulator I'm using does. All right, let's, let's see. Here we go again. Here we go again. Hopefully I can do that. That was a. Uh... I'm rusty, so that was just getting me up to speed. That was, that was a warm up. Hopefully now I won't die again. This game's not particularly hard. That falls. I was trying to skip it. There's something breathing down here. Uh oh! I'm Renegator bait. Oh! I heard that so many times as a kid. Six, three, three. I think that's what he said. <laughs> I wouldn't pay attention again. <clears throat> now later in the game, the only thing that really changes about the game, I think you, there's a couple of other enemies you get. I did. He says 633, didn't he? Come on. I'm gonna crash it right here at the beginning. This game is a lot harder than it looks when you're trying to comment on it as you go. <laughs> you gotta try and shoot these guys. I don't like I said I don't really know if it makes it but okay I can do that. I can remember that. That was my biggest issue as a kid is remembering what he said. Probably too stoned most of the time to remember three simple commands, I guess. Uh, uh, 12 is next, right? Recharge coming up. I think that's a recharge, but it didn't do shit. <laughs> Alright, I got it. 
But yeah, the game is pretty much just like this from beginning to end. They throw... I think I remember a couple of more enemies at you, and at one point you have to follow like a, a bird or a ship or something instead of just coordinates. Which really, that's close to the end of the game, I think, and that was actually easier because you just watch the direction it's going, you don't have to remember anything. Um. There's a whole mess of bogeys. Whole mess of bogeys. Six three niner. I don't know why everybody. Oh, everybody in this game, including the robot, has a southern accent, <laughs> like a deep Texan accent or something. Six three nine. Sorry, the three. Um. But yeah, there's there's not really much variety to the game. What you got here is what you get, but it it, it speeds up a little, maybe. I think. And I think eventually there are some more aggressive enemies, but nothing, remember, nothing too aggressive. I have a score down there in the lower right, but I don't think it makes a fuck. The dying thing bit me! Nine six three, nine or six three. Ooh. I don't think this. I don't think this is a very long game. If memory serves. <clears throat> I know it had a. Uh, the Genesis only had a D-pad, so you had to do all this aiming with a D-pad. I'm pretty sure that was a bitch. Uh, admittedly, using the analog stick on Xbox controller is a little bit easier. I don't know if it's easier. It's, it's still operating as a D-pad. It's just translating it. It's easier on my thumb, I know that. Uh, I don't think he's giving me any important shit, has he? These bats are annoying. Oh, this guy. I'm Commissioner Stenchler. Commissioner, not Mayor, I'm sorry. You know, wasn't too bad, kid. You got real, um, real... Potential! That's it. I played this game way too much. It was a Pac-Man game, okay? Everybody who had a Gen 2 Sega CD, which was most people that had a Sega, D Sega CD, had this game. And this guy, man, nothing's ever good enough for him. I'm doing my best. Sewer Mart Shoppers. It's 3-9er. It's... Radigators. What the fuck is a radigator? Um, like I was saying at some point, uh, the score, I don't know if it makes any difference at all. Really, I could probably just not shoot any of these things, and it would, I don't think it would affect anything. I don't know. Cause they're not like attacking. And I don't, I've got like this little pseudo health bar thing going on under my name, dog meat right there, but I, it's going up and down. I'm not really 100% sure what that does. <laughs> or there's recharge stations too. I've come across one of them. I tried to go through one of them, but I'm not 100% sure what those do either. Oh my god, there's bats everywhere. Have you ever noticed that bats, any game that has bats, or, or birds, bats or birds in it, they're always a pain in the fucking ass? If there are bats or birds in your game, and you're a game designer, rethink your designing. 
because they are like anytime a gamer sees a bat or a bird in a game, you just are instantly annoyed. Okay, Mac. I just stopped shooting. Oh. Oh, look there. In the bottom left corner, energy zero. Hmm. I guess that's what those recharging stations were for. So what do I do? I don't know. Let's find out. I thought the controller bro <laughs> or like I lost connection. <laughs> Do I gain energy back? Falco to ghost. Falco to ghost. It's Falco. Falco? Rock me on the dance. Okay, that was corny. I'm sorry. I should be ashamed. Three twelve six. Well, that's yet to be determined. Ghost of Falco. Three twelve six. Are you nuts? It's almost sector nineteen. Sector nineteen. She's just asking for it. Sector nineteen's a sewer jockey's graveyard. What the fuck is a sewer jockey? What am I doing down here anyway? Turn and burn, dog meat. 312, 312, 312, 6. Oh shit. Was it 312, 6 or 3612? 3, 6. I know 3 first. I think she said 6. We're about to find out. Please be 6, because that's what I'm going with. Or 312, 6. <laughs> 3, 6, 12. It's 12. 312, 6. It was 12. It was 12, not 6. I'm not going. I'm not doing. Yeah, it was 12. Right. I know because it didn't turn red. Ha ha. Is that? I thought that's. I thought I recharged. Fuck. I don't really know. Not, I'm not shooting shit. It's not doing anything. I'm not losing. Whoa, six. So I guess this kind of proves the point that you don't have to actually shoot anything. Just kind of ride it out. Well, this is a bit more, uh, less stressful, I'll give it that. And even the recharge stations, but I don't know how... I don't know how to tell, because you can go left or right at those recharge stations, and I guess only one of them works. I don't know how to tell which one works. I kind of feel like I'm cheating because I'm not doing anything, but I am progressing in the game. I also feel like this is a broken. Bro hey, dog breath or whatever your name is. Dog breath. That was one lousy run. Why should I waste uh waste? Thirty municipal funds at such an obvious boondoggle. That's it. You're a boondoggle. Boondoggle? What the fuck is going drink. on here? What the fuck is happening? Uh, and today's Look at those totals, dog meat. What the fuck is going on here? I told you there was something about a bitch or something. Beach, not bitch. <laughs> what happened? Uh, I guess you do have to shoot a certain amount or you lose. I am really sucking at this. Alright, well, let me... Try again, I guess. Here we go again. Here we go again. I wasn't last time, or the time before that, so hopefully I will be this time, sir. Well, I was talking all kinds of shit about this this game earlier, saying it wasn't difficult. The critters at six, twelve, three. Six, twelve, three. I guess I shouldn't just go around shooting, blowing my load on everything. 12. Hmm. 
be a little bit, a little bit more precise with my energy. Three, six, twelve, three. Why is my energy going down and I'm not shooting? That's not very fair, is it? It goes down more when I shoot. Well, that sucks. Okay, I need to figure out this whole recharge station thing. I'm kind of getting stressed about this now. I don't want to do this again. Kinda, I, I don't want to shoot and waste my energy either, though. <laughs> we got some hungry critters bearing 12, 3, 12. 12, 3, 12. Radigators. I'm sure if anybody's watching this, you probably appreciate not hearing that little... As often now. 12, 3... Oh, shit. What is it? 12, 3, 12? I think it's 12, 3, 12. See, man, my memory is just not what it used to be, and it, it clearly wasn't that good back then either, because I always had issues with this. Oh, oh, I saw it. Okay, I see what it is. I see what I have to do. There's like a red and a green, and you have to... Okay. Whichever side is green, that's the side you can go to. That's the recharge, the side that's uh, active, I guess. All right, hell yeah. It's a little better now. You nailed those chumps. <clears throat> I guess you do have to make a certain score before maybe the level ends? I don't know. But you definitely, if you don't make enough, the level will end and you'll die. I'm hoping to play through this and beat it, so... Six. Three twelve. Three twelve. Three twelve. Hey, you guys remind me of that. Three twelve. This probably would be a good game to stream. Because when I forgot, I could just say, Hey, what was the next coordinate? Twelve is next. So yeah, um, the game is essentially just a rail shooter. Not much to it, exactly what you see here. I said earlier, a couple of, not, when I say a couple, I mean literally a couple, just a few extra bosses show, or a character show up. <sighs> Sorry. It's like four in the morning. Uh... Well... Three! <laughs> um... You get a couple of other enemies that show up at some point, but for the vast majority of the game, this is what you got. You got these little yellow rat things and fucking bats. I think there's like a... There's another kind of animal that shows up. I can't remember what it was. Spider, maybe? Yeah, something like that. So not a lot of variety. But... What makes this game great is not really even so much the gameplay. It's this hey, shit right here. Dog food or whatever your name is. This game, this is the story, Listen, pal, you're gets a so to the fucking 
batshit crazy. If I didn't crazy. have this pressing dinner engagement, I'd come right down there and I'd... I'd... He'd deck you! Yeah, I'd deck you. Deck You're missing eradicators the size of yurks! Step out of it! Shoot the tubes! Did he just slap me? Shoot the tubes. I thought I was doing pretty good. Attention, sewer mart shoppers. They do not practice positive reinforcement. Nine, three, three, nine. Yeah, they should take like a management class or something. Okay, now I'm not doing so good. Okay, three niner. Okay, okay. I need to kill me some radigators so I don't get yelled at by these guys again. So I don't like it. Oh, shit, I missed my turn. All right, guys, um, it is four o'clock in the morning. Um, I got started on this late. Uh, so, yeah, I'm going to call this one a day and we'll, we'll just call today's video a test. And hopefully this turned out good or good enough. And maybe next week I'll revisit Sewer Shark again with a, a little bit a little earlier in the evening. And uh, we'll come back and see more of it and play it from beginning to end but <laughs> i don't know if i got it in me anymore tonight uh i spent a lot of time trying to get this stream thing working and uh hopefully it is if not i'll be kind of heartbroken so uh it looks like it is there's all kinds of shit lighting up and flashing and doing all kinds of stuff so hopefully that's going well but anyway uh yeah next week We'll, we'll call this a test week, and next week we will definitely play Sewer Shark again. I got a few other games on the list. Um, I might skip Sewer Shark. I don't know. We'll see who's interested. If you're interested in seeing me play through this game from beginning to end, giving it a bit more of an effort, then please comment down below and let me know. If, if a couple, few people, I mean, the couple of people that watch this, if you comment and say, yeah, we'd love to see like a full video of it from beginning to end, let me know. I'll do it. If not, I'll, I might move on to something else next week. But uh, so yeah, there there it is. Sewer Shark. If you've never experienced this game, with mo which most likely you have not, um, seeing as how it's a pretty old game, and I think people have heard of it, but a lot of people haven't played it, especially anybody who was born, you know, after the mid '90s, is because there's just not really any easy accessible way to play it right now. So, but I love it still. Um, it kind of humbled me just then. Yeah, it can, it's a really simple fucking game, but it just humbled the shit out of me. <laughs> but, you know, whatever. I, I had some technical difficulties, and it is late as shit. I also had something else happen to me, just real quick before I go. Something else happened to me today. <laughs> I am going to post a video of this tomorrow. Um either on Twitter for sure. I, I may put a short video on YouTube about it, since, especially since this one is a lot shorter and, and not as, as full as I would have liked originally. So I might throw this little blooper up from uh, my latest video. I was, I, I was recording a video for not today or tomorrow, but it's a couple of days out. Um, tomorrow's video is already uh, recorded and up and everything, but it's Friday's at the, or Thursday? Thursday's video, I believe. And, uh, I guess when you're watching this, it'll be tomorrow's video. If you're watching it when it first, whatever. It's a video I have coming out for my video game movie series or video game movie review series. The next in line for that. And there's a moment in it. Um, I don't want to spoil it, but we'll just say that there's a time, there's a part where I try and, uh, I try out a skill that I do not have, and I try and do something to look cool, 
in a certain moment and I get I get pretty determined and with things so I, I continue to try it and I keep failing at it and I try and I try and I try for a long time there's a shit ton of takes on it but um and things are thrown and flung and all that but at one point <laughs> Uh, the things that I have in my hand that I'm twirling around, which are metal, at one point, <laughs> I, I lose it and one of them flies up and busts me in the face, like really hard. And it hurts so fucking bad. So yeah, I'm going to blame this. <laughs> and I got it all on tape too. It's, admittedly, looking back, it's pretty funny. It was not funny when it happened though. But um, I am going... My lips are a little swollen still right here on my nose, but I'm going to chalk my subpar shit performance on this game tonight, or this morning, whenever you're watching this, to being pistol whipped in the face by myself today. So <laughs> I'm, I'm going to say that's one, and I'm going to come back to this one. I am. I'm going to come back to Sewer Shark, and I'm going to give it another go. And I'm I'm gonna beat it this time. It's, it's not gonna beat me. I hope. I, I'm pretty sure. I feel fairly confident in that. If if I do come back and I fail miserably again, then you know I will just have to come up with another reason why I failed. It's not my fault. <laughs> I swear I beat this game back in the day. I don't remember the ending. I remember something about a beach. I remember there being a beach. I remember the story being fucking insane. But besides that, anyway, I'm talking too much. Yeah, hardly anybody's watching this, I'm sure, anyway, and if you are, you've probably tuned out by this point, but yeah, there it is, Sewer Shark, um, hope you enjoyed what little there was, this one, like I said, was a bit more of a test, so there's other things going on that I was testing and paying more attention to, so sorry, it's not as long, not as thorough, but, you know, these are the kind of things we gotta do to make things work right, and so I can, so I can bring you quality content in the future um, especially since I'm now trying to branch out to streaming but if I stream I don't just want to stream a picture or something I want to try and do it you know the best I can that's what my subscribers and if you're watching this anyone who watches my content I think you deserve the best I can absolutely give and that is what I will always try and do won't always succeed but I will try anyway guys as usual if you liked what you've seen here Hit the like and subscribe buttons. Uh, visit my channel for other movie reviews. Uh, I put up reviews almost every day of the week except Saturday. That is my day off. And uh, yeah, uh, I'm going to be doing this uh, retro walkthrough play, let's play through, let's play review thing on old games from my past every Wednesday for the foreseeable future. I mean, if it turns out to be a thing just like absolutely nobody's watching, um, then I probably will stop because why would I put myself through this? But these are games I enjoy. I'm, I'm going back and playing these because I enjoy them. Uh, not, I don't expect these to be, be big view count videos, but I do enjoy them. I enjoy them a lot, and uh, and I'm really wanting to stream. Whoa! I'm really wanting to stream these because I enjoy uh, talking. To the, to to the, uh, the 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 fans. I hate to say that. I don't. I don't picture myself having fans, but um, the community. Yeah, there you go. Community. I like interacting with the community, and I think it'd be fun to do these while uh, interacting with the community firsthand uh, live. But yeah, anyway, that's coming, hopefully, real soon. And uh, yeah, so next week you will either see a. Sewer Shark, round two, or another game that I have in mind that's uh, a long one, but not quite as stressful. Um, I don't know. I don't know which one I'm going to do yet. I don't, I've don't. i got something scheduled, but I'm not, I'm not 100% sure if that's what I'll go with or not. We'll see. Anyway, this was fun. <laughs> I can't, it was. But uh, yeah, like and subscribe if you enjoyed the content. If you made it this far, you are a fucking trooper and you deserve it prize i don't have any though sorry so uh yeah do that and i will see you guys next week